when it comes to Afghanistan, for years on end, we've reported on the violence, the crimes and the abuses against humanity. Now the country is embroiled in a political dispute regarding a rebuilding of a dam that neighbors Iran. However, the locals are positive of this revival project. Construction work on at last at the Baksh Abad Dam in western Afghanistan's Farah province that borders Iran. The output, irrigation for more than 100 hectares of land, generation of 27 megawatts of electricity. There are bigger benefits too, development of the presently backward region, related road and construction projects are likely to follow. The locals are hopeful the activity will bring back many who had left for employment reasons. The more immediate benefits lie there. The paradapar. The construction of this dam can be like a beehive for agriculture of Farah and half of Afghanistan. And this can provide job opportunities not only to the residents of Farah, but also to the people from neighboring provinces. The project will cost $430 million. A domestic firm will carry out dam construction work. German and Turkish firms are enabling technical assistance. Phase 1 will include construction of two tunnels targeted for 10 months. This will extend to plates, road asphalting work, building canals and more. The Helmand River on which the Baksh Abad Dam is being constructed flows from the central Afghan province Helmand for more than 1,000 kilometers into Lake Hamun which straddles the Afghanistan-Iran border. The number of irrigation streams that have dried up or the wells that have dried up will become active with the construction of this dam. To the outside world, it is perhaps the first signal of any administrational or welfare work by the Taliban leadership. Real efforts to pick up the pieces of this battered nation are long overdue. Afghanistan is not a small country. As the Minister of Energy and Water mentioned, our roads are broken, our other infrastructure is in the same condition, dams as well. There is not a single thing that doesn't need reconstruction. But all's not positive all the way. Neighbour Iran has come out fuming on the Baksh Abad Dam restricting flow of water into the country. It accuses Afghan authorities of not meeting water treaty obligations. The exercise falls into the realm of politicized water and river sharing disputes as seen around the world. Development and humanity are pushed to a back seat.